very good morning dear uh, students last uh, two classes i explained about uh, introduction to the color image processing and uh, models color models rgb hsi and uh, cmy models these three models i was explained now after these uh, color models how to convert from one model to another <coughs> model we have the rgb model but in our applications i want to know hsi model <coughs> by the time how we are going to convert it at what kind of equation or what kind of parameters to use to convert for example can assume rgb model is available is convert into the hsi model the rgb values have been normalized to the very parameters 0 and 1 and angle theta is measured with respect to the red axis of hsi space the equation is available the conversion equation rg sectors gb sectors and br sectors in rg sectors theta 0 less than or equal to h less than or equal to 120 degree in gb sectors we start from 120 to 240 and in the br sectors 240 to 360 full circle rg sectors totally will be considered from 0 to 120 degree now the relation between rgb and hsi <coughs> model the representation of both rgb and hsi color models first we will take that first model here all eight colors it will be considered black white blue yellow cyan red green magenta this is what now by using that equations to convert with an angle theta so here in the first representations u and saturation in the hsi model the dot is the arbitrary color points the angle from red axis gives the u and the length of the vector is the saturation and along with that the intensity of all colors in any of these planes is given by position of the plane on the vertical intensity axis so this is what the representation for that now we'll come to the another two pseudo colors and true colors what do you mean by pseudo colors assigning color to gray level values based on the certain criteria it is called as a true colors major use is interpretation of gray level images here the two mainly two techniques are used one is called as intensity slicing second one is called as color transformation now in the pseudo colors we will going to discuss about these two intensity slicing and color transformations what do you mean by intensity slicing the intensity slicing is nothing but let us start from 0 to 
L minus 1, that's what a gray scale, 0 to 255, L is 255. So here in the intensity slicing, I slice the plane, how to represent that gray level axis. The origin we have to represent 0, x and y coordinates. Slicing is to be considered. This is what the geometric representation of intensity slice technique. See here the representation of intensity slice technique. And gray level to color transformations. How we are going to transform the colors? Please look into these black representations. We can take f of x comma y. We can pass it into the red transformation, gray transformations and blue transformations will become f of r x y, f of g and f of b. This is what we call as a functional block diagram for pseudo color image processing. So here, this is what the pseudo color processing. Same thing in the previous what we explained that with adding our additional processing will become HS, HR, HG and HB monochrome images are available. This is what we call as a monochrome images. And uh, full color image processing, processing techniques applicable to both full color images. We have two techniques process each component image individually and from process component color images work with color pixels directly so in this color transformation j of x comma y is equal to transformation of t of f of x comma y t is the transformation on colored image f of x comma y and g of x comma y is a transferred image. The difference between color and gray level transformation is color transformation. Pixels are a group of triplets. The color transformation have the form like this. n is equal to 3 or 4. If n is equal to 3 for RGB and HSI, if n equal to 4, that is be called as another model, CMYK models. So in any transformation can be performed in any color models. See here, color complements. It is a general representation. This is what as per the syllabus, the content will be prescribed. So, shall I wind up these, the today's class? This is what only the, not there in your syllabus, only this much will Completed. Thank you.